Hey everybody, welcome back to some more early morning barking, talking about BPD and MPD by somebody that has both. Don't forget to hit the like and the subscribe buttons and do all the socially things scrolling past you on the screen. I also have a Patreon. Thank you to everyone who supports me there. And there's a link in the description below. Today, I'm going to help you out a little bit. I've got some good advice. This is good stuff. Stick with me. Because at the time I'm recording this, if you're watching in the future, it might not be so relevant, but again, stick with me. I'm recording this on New Year's Eve. And the reason why I'm recording it on New Year's Eve is because traditionally, this is the time of uh, year where we decide to punish ourselves for no reason. And I thought it would be a good idea to make a video to say, don't do that. Here's what we do. It's resolution time, right? It's time to give everything up and become the person that we always dreamed we could be. If only we could show some commitment and enthusiasm, the likes of which we have never shown before in our lives, right? It's ridiculous. We're going to set ourselves up to fail because it's nearly January. It's what we do. Humans are clever. We can do some amazing things. And we're also really stupid and can do some really stupid things. And this is the latter of those two. See, I've got lots of things I'd like to change, right? I'd like to eat better, sleep better, do less things that are bad for me, all kinds of stuff. I really would. And I, I know that. And I wanted to do those things yesterday. I want to do them today. And I'm going to want to do them tomorrow. But... Why would I want to set up a rule for myself? If I set up a rule, if I decide as of tomorrow, I'm only going to go to bed at 10 o'clock. And then tomorrow night, I don't go to bed at 10 o'clock because I've set myself an unreasonable, optimistic goal. Then I've already failed. Day one. If I... I don't know, anything else, if I want to eat less chocolate, I, I'm just setting myself up for failure. And it's a punishment, right? These are punishments. These aren't fun. These aren't good things. They're where we've decided we've been bad and it's time for punishment now. So you've had all the chocolate, no chocolate for you. You've been staying up late, go to bed early every night forever. Why are we doing this? Is that, is that something that's going to make us better? Is this going to help us in some way? I don't think so. It's not. We're going to set unrealistic goals. We're going to fail at them. Then we're going to punish ourselves for failing at the unrealistic goals we set. And we did it all because it's going to be a new year. Why? Why? We've already been through Christmas and Christmas is difficult enough. Why Why are we adding this new thing on? The, there's no good answer. And I'm just saying, stop it. Stop it now, right? You are not going to become the dream version of you tomorrow. I'm sorry. It would be great. It really would. And I wish we could do it. And I wish I could do it and you could do it. And tomorrow, everything that bothers us about ourselves would be over and done with. But it's not going to happen. It, it's just not, and I, I, I'm sorry. So if you're laboring under the impression that there's something you can do in the next 24 hours that will solve this problem, I, there's not. You, you have to make change gradually. You, you have to do it a bit at a time. You know, don't eat chocolate for breakfast tomorrow. Try that. You know, don't wake up and smoke something. Don't wake up and have a drink. Look, we all have demons and some of them are bigger than others and you have to take whatever you're dealing with and break it down. As I've always talked about, baby steps. I can't make all these changes tonight. I can't, I can't do it. But what I can do is I, I can identify what I want to change, why I want to change it, how it negatively affects me, 
and steps I can take to break down doing that thing less. We're talking about harm reduction here. You're going to do these things. So let's just try and do them in a way that's less bad. And then when we're doing that, we can do them a bit less and a bit less. And eventually we'll not do these things. But honestly, the system of tomorrow I'm making changes. This really applies any time of year. <laughs> you know, big sweeping changes across the board that are going to come in tomorrow are not going to work. They're not going to help you. They're going to hurt you because you're going to fail at them because you've set an unrealistic goal. You've set a goal of being better now. You can't do that. You can't just decide, I'm going to be better now. There, done it. Ha. If it was that simple, I'd make one video and be done. It would be called Stop It. There. <laughs> and yet, once a year it rolls around and we think, oh, this year, I'm going to become the awesome version of me. Well, you might. But not in one day. Not in one day. So give yourself a break. Look, set resolutions. Have goals. Aim for things. Look at ways that you think you can be better. By all means. I'm not discouraging that. You can do this. This is a channel where I'm talking about making yourself better. Of course you can make yourself better but not in 24 hours. And I'm saying it, doesn't it sound ridiculous? Doesn't it sound absolutely insane that we do this? As of tomorrow, no more of these things. Definitely gonna happen. Have you met you? Do you know how you work? Because I do, you work like me. Don't feel bad about that. Just face palm and go, yes, if I was going to do that, that was never going to work. And then let's look at some realistic goals. Let's look at something you actually can do. And maybe that thing is just doing the bad thing a little bit less. Maybe it's doing it one less time. And then maybe when you do it one less time a week, maybe you can do it two less times a week, you know, baby steps. And of course, if you have anything big that you're dealing with seek out help don't go through things alone there are people out there who can help you organizations who are set up to help you and people with experience and stuff like that i'm just an idiot with a microphone and a camera on youtube okay go and get help if there's help to be had go and get that help and don't punish yourself for needing it you take care i'll see you later Bye.